I'm not what you can, I'm not what you really consider a really good drinker. Um, I started very late. I didn't start drinking until I was like 24, 25. So I had this ex-girlfriend whose name is Maria, and not because all I dated was Latin girls, but because that's who lived in my neighborhood and I'm lazy, right? So every time we went out, she would give me a hard time. She'd be like, you know what? It's no fun to go out with you because when we go out, I drink and you don't. I'm like, yeah, I know, because somebody has to drive. And she didn't care, so finally there's a night where we go out and I'm like, you know what, baby? I'm gonna have a drink with you tonight, but help me out, let me know what I should get. And she's like, I, no, 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 I don't know what you're gonna like, go random. On your first night of drinking, whoever you're with should never tell you to go a random, because it's gonna go a wrong. So I was like, okay, you're useless, I'll figure this out by myself. I see the bartender shaking up a tall drink, he slides it down the bar and somebody starts to drink it. And I was like, bartender, I'll have whatever you just made that dude over there. He gave me the bartender head nod and he shook up another tall drink. I'm gonna describe this drink to you. And if you know it, we're gonna have a moment to say it together. It is a tall glass filled to the top of the ice. It is clear, a tint of yellow and a tint of brown with a wedge of lemon on the corner. What I ordered on my first night of drinking ever is a Long Island iced tea. From the sounds of it, many of you have met this whore. <laughs> because here's the thing about a Long Island, if it is made properly, you're not supposed to taste the alcohol. And this place made it very proper. Because I smashed the first one because it is a hot 96 degree day in Chicago summertime. And I crush it. And I don't know what alcohol tastes like. And I'm like, mm, love it, iced tea. I destroy the first one. I was like, oh bartender, that was easy. Let me get another one. He slides me another one. I crush that one. I was like, mm, mm, one more time. Ask for a third one. I get to my third Long Island iced tea. And I don't know what drunk is. I just know that just by chance, all of a sudden my ears are getting really hot. And I'm swaying in place like a tree in the wind. And all of a sudden my ex-girlfriend Maria was like, oh my goodness, what's wrong with you? I was like, I don't know, but I'm having a good time. Who's ready to party? And I started to become my Uncle Sharish. And she's like, what's wrong with you? I was like, I don't know, but donuts for everyone. Uh, yeah, that didn't work out either, so.